Hey, what's up, guys? Um, it's Terry. Um, I guess you could say I'm your coach. And um, also, I just wanted to make a quick video um, just to say that I don't even think this is an introduction video because honestly, I honestly don't have time to do it and upload it on YouTube. But so I'll just do this real quick and put it on Facebook. Um, I just want to let you guys know all the little motivation stuff you guys do. And all the little postings, I see all of it, and I'm very happy and thankful and proud of you guys. Um, here's the deal. I post a lot. My clout score is ridiculous. Like, I post a lot. I post a lot. I probably blast 25 social media posts a day, and I'm trying to do the best to shout out all the Team Fidelis athletes and get them going and make you guys pictures and, um, you know, your picture collages. So anytime you have, like... You know, a couple times a week, get a good picture of yourself working out in the gym or have someone take it and then text it to me so I can put it through my apps and do all my stuff and then shout it out um, and tag people in it and stuff like that. Um, just to try to get people following you and, and understanding your journey and what you're trying to do and to inspire people. Because as inspiring as it is that you're working hard behind the scenes and stuff and that's all great and that's a, you know, that's a great work ethic and I, I live by that to the fullest, but people... In this time, it's 2013, they need to see visual image of what you're doing, okay? People will people will forget what you say, but they're going to remember what you do. Um, and, you know, there's so many people out there that just love to look at that stuff and, and, and get inspired. I mean, I can go through Instagram all day and be like, man, you know, I can find stuff that inspires me. So um, that's another thing. Um, so, like, I try to shout everyone out and do the do the, the best I can. And then also, <clears throat> my coach, Louis Riddell, is, he does this shout-outs for me, and I try to promote myself as well because even though I am your guys' coach and <clears throat> getting you guys ready for shows to kick ass and take names, I'm also getting my, you know, my my social stuff out there for me because I am um, going for that IFBB Pro Card this year and trying to get on the national stage or am getting on two national stages, one in um, June in Junior Nationals in California and then USA 2013 in Vegas, um, which is going to be awesome. So I am going to show up my best to those shows and try to make you guys proud. Um, and we'll see what happens, you know, at Nationals. Um, right now, getting ready for the Cal, May 25th. We'll go see what we can do there. If you can win that show, your title is Mr. California. So that is an honor. It's one of the most prestigious titles you can have as an amateur. And I am eat, sleeping, and dreaming of that right now. But with that being said, I have a lot of online clients. I do. Probably, I don't know, over 200. But here's the deal. They are awesome and amazing, but my Team Fidelis athletes who are actually getting ready for shows, I put a lot of attention into. So um, your guys' meal plans and everything you do with your check-ins and everything, those get really critiqued when I'm going over them. Um, I actually, everyone on Team Fidelis has a little star by their name in my iPhone, so I know if you text me, I need to hurry up and get back to you as soon as I can. If I take a little bit to get back to you, it's because I'm either in the gym or taking a nap because... Uh, I really don't sleep at night. I just take naps. I maybe get four hours of sleep at night. But I'm doing my best to get this going. I have a meeting today with um, with somebody. Bring them on as like uh, more secretary for to do some stuff for me. I got to give a huge thank you to Lazarus Ross, um, one of my hard hitters. Um, but he also helps me with all my social media stuff for the team page and everything. So you guys get to know Laz. He's a good guy, kind of like my right hand man. Um, Anyway, so I have nine guys and a couple girls um, going to nationals this year so far, USA. So we're going to roll deep as a family. I am trying to get as many of you qualified as I can. I want to roll like 15 deep to USA's. Um, get a big suite. We all go there, compete, have a hell of a time. And then, you know, pull parties the next day on Sunday. <laughs> but whatever happens, on this team, I just want you guys to know it's not about... I honestly know, okay, if you want to go pro and you want to do stuff like that, of course, you have to win. But you got to enjoy the journey. It's not going to happen. For me, you know, it may not even happen this year. It may take three years down the road, but I'm going to try it and, you know, fight tooth and nail for it until it does happen. Because that's what I want to do. And a lot of you, that's what you want to do. And even if you just want to get on stage, you know, just to have fun and compete, that's fine. We'll do it. But I don't really care about the trophies and placings. With hard work and tireless effort, those will come. What I care about is sticking to the plan, following it, not cheating, and doing exactly what you're doing because I promise you, you stick to my plan, and I'm not trying to sound cocky, but I can bring you in the best you can. Um, you, you can ask anybody who's worked with me. If you stick to the plan, you will be shredded. 
that's the reputation I want to have is just bringing my people in shredded, peeled. Um, it's a lot of hard work. I'm really trying to do the best I can. And, you know, it's going to be a good journey. It's going to be a good time for all of us if we, if we just stick to the plan, myself included. So I ordered some T-shirts yesterday. Um, well, they came in yesterday. I ordered them last week. I got black and red V-neck T-shirts. I got cut-off sleeveless shirts. And then I got tank tops. And for the women, I got um, cut-off sleeveless and little bitty V-neck T-shirts and tank tops as well, uh, red and black. And I'm going to get the logos all printed on those in the next week. And then I'll be, you know, getting them all shipped out to everyone. And everyone, they'll be, they'll be really cheap, so don't worry about it. So another thing is everyone needs to contact Erin Pogis. Um, I always mess her last name up, but she's one of my clients out here. She's on Team Fidelis. I train her one-on-one as well. Um, tremendous athlete. Uh, that girl's got more heart than a lion, I'm telling you. But anyway, you guys need to contact her because all my little cool cover photos and stuff she does and... She gets my pro sub photo shoot pictures and stuff like that. All those little, all that little stuff she puts all my graphics together. So you know she'll charge you guys the cheapest price. I want everyone to get Team Fidelis photo covers on their Facebook page because it looks professional and no one else does that. I want to do something no one else is doing. Um, that's the only way to get ahead in this game. And also, I'm very proud of everyone I bring on the team. And there's kind of like a little screening process. I don't just take on anyone. So. Um, if you're on the team, it's because we want you there and because I know that I can work with you. And I'm proud of everyone who's on the team. There'll be more people coming. Laz, you're doing a hell of a job. Um, you know, I got you guys and Mark and uh, Mathena, a whole bunch of dudes. I can't name them all right now. Plus, I'm driving and traffic's crazy. But I'm excited to get you guys ready for USA's. Uh, and, you know, it's going down in Sin City, 2013, USA's, baby. All right. Thank you, everyone on the team, for all your support in doing it. And uh, I really appreciate it. Peace.